Hey, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the gripping world of Locked in My House. This one's a roller coaster of emotions, let me tell you. So, picture this Karis, our protagonist, is dealing with some serious stuff. Dr. Merrick, the guy who hurt her, has her life turned upside down. But instead of sitting back and waiting for justice to come knocking, she takes matters into her own hands. I mean, talk about a strong lead, right? But here's where it gets intense. Karis tracks down Dr. Merrick and pulls off this crazy move, getting him all trapped in her basement. I mean, who does that? But hey, when you're desperate for the truth, you do what you gotta do. Now, just when you think things couldn't get any crazier, Karis's friend Renee goes and kidnaps Dr. Merrick. Yeah, you heard me right. Kidnaps. And get this, she's planning to do the unthinkable. I'm talking about taking justice into her own hands, if you catch my drift. But Karis, she's a whole other level of hero. She realizes that saving Dr. Merrick is the only way to truly serve justice. So, she's on this race against time to rescue the guy who hurt her, all so he can face the consequences of his actions. And let me tell you about the cast. We've got Natalie Brown leading the charge as Karis, bringing so much raw emotion to the screen. And Damon Runyon? He's the perfect mix of charming and sinister as Dr. Merrick. Laura Burke, Lara Amerzi, and Morgan Kelly round out the ensemble, delivering performances that'll leave you on the edge of your seat. So mark your calendars, folks, because Locked in My House drops on Thursday, April 18th at 8-7C. You do not want to miss this wild ride. Trust me, you'll be glued to the screen from start to finish.